Jaden Hansen, or does anyone know who that is? Oh, okay. 
All right, we're going to get rolling because that took forever. Have you guys found the area of a trapezoid before? No. I bet you have. Anyone know the formula? No. Kind of. Half your height times your bases added together. Oh. You're kind of close. Yeah. Just remember the bases of your trapezoid are the parallel ones, the ones that will never touch. So half times your height times your bases added together. That's your formula. So if we just plug into this first one here, what is our height? Uh, 15. 15. What's one of our bases? 40. 40. What's our other one? And the order of those don't matter. And honestly, you guys, after you do this, just type it in. Right? So I just put 0.5 for a half times 15, parentheses, 40 plus 18. Should be 435. Isn't that amazing? Calculator is a tool. Use it. It's more efficient. And we do have a unit, meters. Uh, square. square. That's it. Wow. Meter square. Same thing on the next one. It just rotated on us. What's our height? Probably a solid 28. Agreed. What's one of our bases? Probably 24. 24, yep. And the other one? Probably a solid 12. You're probably right. <laughs> Do we agree with 504? Solid. We're not getting 504? 504? Do we have a unit? Yards. Are we not getting 504? Yeah, Okay, our formula for the area of a kite and rhombus. Yeah, we're going to use our diagonals. That's what D1 and D2 stand for. So D1 times D2 divided by 2. Take your diagonals, times each other, and we're going to divide by 2. Or you could write it this way, half D1 times D2. Just make sure it's a multiplication sign between your diagonals. You're not adding them, you're multiplying. And then the diagonals go from corner to corner. Okay, hey, what's one of our diagonals here? 15. 15. What's our other one? 60. Should just be 60 if you type it in. Meters. This next one's a little trickier. What's the length of this diagonal? 20. Yeah, 10 plus 10 is 20. What about the other guy? 24. What'd you get, sir? Do yeah. you have a unit? Uh, C squared. Perfect. You didn't say anything last year. Okay, hey, you guys do the next one. I'll catch up to you. I'll catch up.
What did you do on the first one? 84. 84, give a unit. Meters. No, millimeters squared. Perfect. Second one? 72. Is that okay? Okay, when you're ready, flip it over. We got to work backwards to find the missing measure. So this one says one diagonal of a rhombus is twice as long as the other. If the area of the rhombus is 169 square millimeters, what are the lengths of the diagonals? Do a little labeling, it will make your life easier. D1, D2. Do we know what the length of one of our diagonals at all? Were we given a length? No. No. So what can we call one of them? 2x. X. X. And we know the other one's twice the length of that, so what would that be? 2x. Perfect. It'd be 3x equals 169. Um, no. You're close, but not quite. Sorry, I write out my formula because that's easier to see. Yes, that's 5 by 2 inches. What is our area? Close to 5x. Of our aromas? Uh... Oh, 169. Yep. So 169 plug in x times 2x all over 2. Did you write upside down? Upside down that. Yep, I was thinking of the formula. Thank you for that. <laughs> Making up my own math up here. Should we simplify the numerator? What's x times 2x? 2x squared, there's an imaginary yeah. one here. 1 yeah. times 2 is 2. x times x is x squared. Well, this is convenient. X squared. What happens to my 2 is? It goes away. They go away. 169 squared, 15. Wow. Isn't that great? Square root of 169. OK, now answer the question, what's it wondering? Diagonal. So one's 13. What's the other one? 26. Very good. That's all right. I have, I have some wipes right here. Okay, you guys get a head start on the next one. Plug into the formula. We'll work backwards together.
No, no, and then you divide by 6.5. Yeah. I'm making 2.5. Where did you get 6.5? Oh, half of 13. Yes, half of 13. Divide by 6. Sadly, we don't get a nice number. 6.2. I accept that. Looks like No. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, wow. And you got to be good. Yes. Hey folks, we got one we got to fix on the back. On the back where it says 13.9, will you make it... Um, 14.3 on the back where it says 13.9 make it 14.3 and then you got to show me one step